how to integrate Square with Wix. Hello guys and welcome to this new tutorial. Today I am going to show you how you can integrate Square for the payment methods, which is a very sophisticated platform to take some payments or it is a payment gateway platform to your Wix website. It is very easy and very simple. All you have to do is to follow up the tutorial from the beginning till the end and you will be good to go. The first thing that you need to do is to go to Wix.com. Sign into your account and then simply you are going to select the website that you are going to set the square payment for it. In my case, I have three websites. If you don't have a website yet, simply click on create a new website and you will get the help of the AI tool or you can go ahead and select any template from the library. Now I have already a website. Click on select and edit site. We have our dashboard set up. You can see we have everything set up right there. You can go ahead and connect a custom domain and set up the payment methods. You can go ahead and see the website right there by just clicking on edit website or edit site. Let's go ahead right here to the left side menu and scroll a little bit until we see here settings right there. Square will be available only in Canada and the United States. And for that to work, make sure to set up the language and the regions for the United States or Canada. When you are on the settings, simply go ahead and see the language and region, click on it, and here we have the site language. Obviously, you, it should be, or it must be English. And the original format, we are going right there to put, for example, right here, English. Let's go ahead and see the English right there from Canada, for example, or the English from the United States. Here we have the currency. Go ahead and put it as a US dollars. Or you can go ahead and put it as yeah, the Canadian dollar. I'm going to change the currency. And here we have it. Now for the time zone, Go ahead and put the right time zone for the United States and also for Canada. Now you can go ahead and put whatever you want from here and you will set everything. Click on save and here we have it. This is the first step. Now the second step is to go back to the settings and click on accept payments. For the accepting payments, here we have the region set to the Canada. Your business location is Canada. Right here, you cannot already see the square. So we are going to scroll down a little bit, click on see more payment options. And here we are going to search for the square if it is available right there. We have Afterpay. Alipay, Bankful, Klarna, all of these well-known uh, payment getaways, AAA, debit card, slash card via monaries, and etc. Until now, we don't see Square yet. So we are going to click on third-party credit slash debit card providers. Click on see options. And here we have Stripe, Square and Braintree and etc. Simply you are going to click on and select Square. Click on connect. Now we have some steps to follow. To connect your Square account, click connect to sign in to your Square account. Once signed in, your Square account will be connected to your Wix account. Can't find your credentials or won't connect? contact square simply here we are going to see the payment methods available with square we have a lot we have credit slash debit cards from the visa card mastercard american express and a lot simply click on connect 
and then we are going to see the getaway or the platform between Square and Wix. Here you are going to set the Square account. A little disclaimer guys, everything created in this video such as accounts and email addresses are created for the sake of the video. They are not used for any personal uses. So I have set my password, click on sign in and we will wait for the next step to appear. Here we have the Wix application which wants to access to our Square account. Here we have the allow Wix to view your payment history, take payments and make refunds, collect a fee from each payment taken, view your merchant profile information, view your customer information and finally modify your customer information. You have or you must allow these actions to be able to connect your square to your Wix. Click on allow and simply it will give you the access. Square is connected, it's, uh, it's time to upgrade your site. Upgrade your site with a business and e-commerce premium plan to start accepting payments with credit slash debit cards. Here it is a paid feature. Since you have added the payment getaway, you have to set up yourself or your plan to a higher plan. You can go ahead and click on upgrade. Then you will see the suited or the made plan for your current situation. We have the business elite. We have the business, the core and the light. In our case, the highly recommended it is the business plan. It is set to $22 per month. You can go ahead and select that and go ahead and check it out. We have some integration or some benefits within this plan. 10 collaborators, 100 gigs, storage space, standard marketing suit, free domain for one year, standard site analytics, accept payments and this is the most important part and standard e-commerce. You can go ahead and add the core or get the core plan since it has the accept payments and also the advanced e-commerce and accept payment within the business elite. When you finish this, you are simply going back to the store that you have within Wix and congratulations with your Square account. Here we have set up the account and not accepting payment yet because we didn't upgrade. You can manage the account right here. We have the account information, account location, and the payment methods available. Here it is not letting us to accept the payments yet. So you need to upgrade your business also. When you finish everything right there, Square is connected. And here it is your role to set up your website correctly Make your products from here, for example, for the catalog, click on catalog, you will see your products, make them and put the right prices. Again, upgrade your plan and boom, you will be good to go. That was all for today's video. I hope you guys that you have enjoyed the content and hope to see you soon on the next one.